Hey, fellow forester friends, what variety of cherry fruit tree do we have here? I don't recognize it. It's a cherry. <laughs> yeah, I can't tell what it is. Secretary, if you lean back a little more, it's a little <clears throat> Really try that hip thrust. The hip thrust really helps. Yeah, you're getting it. All right. You're doing great. Yeah. Catch your breath if you need to. There's two styles of climbing. There's SRT, which stands for stationary rope technique. If you've ever seen video of a person going up a rope almost like a ladder. Yeah. It's faster, but it's a little bit more complex. This is called DRT, dynamic rope technique. And it's a little slower, but it works. It works. Earlier today, we uh, removed some old hardware that was screwed and hammered into this tree from probably back in the old days. So there's a wound right here where we removed that piece of metal, which is just a friendly reminder to don't put, don't put metal in trees. If you're making maple syrup, that's great. You take it out at the end of the season, but there's, I, there's very few instances where a piece of metal should remain in a tree permanently. So don't. Yeah, don't do it. <laughs> You're doing great. So you did this at Ag Progress Days. Yeah, like uh, <clears throat> 10 years ago. Right? So it's not like it's, it's been a long time. You yeah. do it every evening? Huh? No. This is a red oak. Red oak's lumber is absolutely beautiful. Used for furniture, hardwood floors. Help me out, Stephanie. What else do we use our red oak for? Everything. Cabinets, molding, millwork, It's the number one hardwood species yeah. in the U.S. But, but not whiskey and wine barrels. Why not? It's porous. Your white oak. I'm looking for a white oak. The white oak has tylosis, and, and that's what makes white oak waterproof or whiskey proof or wine proof. It's also why shipbuilders in the old days liked white oak for building, for at least framing the ships and the decking and things like that. It's the state tree of Maryland, white oak. I went and climbed one in Maryland last month. I'm gonna try and get as many state trees as I can. Uh, what, what state would that be? Our, is there a black cherry state? Pennsylvania. Oh, <laughs> no, I did a hemlock, though, a really big hemlock. I ran out of rope. The, the hemlock I did was, might have been the highest I've ever been off the ground. Wow. Where at? Wow. Uh, Dutlinger Natural Area up in uh, Hammersley. Okay. Nice. But I, how, how did you get the uh, rope up? So there's a, a throw bag. It's about a, a 10 ounce, looks like a hacky sack and it's attached to a string. And I have a slingshot. Oh, okay. And uh, I launch that thing. If you can get to this limb, you're gonna be really comfortable. Like, you can come up and like sit on it or stand on it, you'll be able to rest your... I'm good here. You're good there? Yeah. Good. I'm gonna get a picture of it if you don't mind. That's a really cool band. <laughs> How's the view up there? Uh, the view's amazing. I mean, that's uh, <laughs> it's amazing. It's incredible. Wow. All right, you ready for a picture? Yeah, let's do it. One, two, three. Now I'm gonna take a selfie with you. 
One, two, three. That's a good one. Now I'll cheat. I'll make us look way high off the ground. One, two. All right. Cool. Well, thank you, Red Oak. Quercus ruba or rubrum, I forget the site. Rubra. Thank you. Somebody paid attention. Shall we go down? Yeah. Sure. Okay. Do you see right here? As you gently push down on that top, it releases. Uh -huh. If you want to go slower or stop, just stop pushing down on it. Yeah. Cool. He's coming down. Yep. Climb number 46. Secretary Reddy now has the record for the second highest climb in the history of the county. <laughs> Actually, he might be tied with you, John. <laughs> I gotta go a little higher. Good job. <laughs> Secretary, would you agree? It's a slight, it's a different perspective up here. Like when you're in the trees, it's different than just hiking. So I'm told that on a clear day, you can see even further, but the view's spectacular today, so I won't complain. If I'm not mistaken, Cambria County High Point's that way. I'm headed there next to meet my friend Brian Pearson, and High Point of Blair County is that way-ish.